Welcome back to another studio vlog. It's now Wednesday. So the footage you saw from before was from yesterday and today morning. On Monday, I kind of stayed at home and I did a lot of admin work. I did lists like of products and like prices, all that kind of boring stuff. And yesterday I came in the studio and I thought I could take care of some new products. So I did two new notepads that I'll show you in a little bit. I did new notebook designs and I also created some new socks designs as well. So I have a lot to do. I have a lot of notepads to mount and a lot of notebooks as well. Today and tomorrow we are going to have a little marathon of putting them together. I also did some Patreon work. I did a printable for this month that is like kind of a sticky sheet, kind of a print. <laughs> um, it depends on what you want to do with it. I'm going to post a picture 
of it over here if you want to check that out. I would love if you would come to my Patreon and support my work over there. Um, it really helps on keep creating these videos and keep creating art. Now it's like the beginning of the month, so it's the perfect timing for you to sign up there uh, and you can cancel anytime and, or change your pledge anytime. So yeah, that'll make me really, really happy. But yeah, let me show you everything that I've been doing. So these are the new notebooks. They are the little strawberry ones and these are the ASICs. And I did this ones and I also did the gardening ones that I think looks super super cute. I still need to cut them out. Then I have this big pile over here that I've been accumulating for two weeks now probably. These are older designs that I really want to restock. These designs are still from the phase where I was printing the covers and laminating them outside. So I have a lot of stock um, and it's updated on my shop but I wanted to do them all so that that um, I can like see them done. I'm not sure how to explain it. And these ones are newer designs that are already put together, but I already need to restock some more, like the pastries ones and stuff like that. And let me show you this big stack over here. So this is older designs. And as you can see, I still have a lot, lots and lots of stocks. So I would really like to um, mount them all so I can see them on the shelf and not having this big pile of covers over here. I already have them here for so so long, probably two years. So that's why I also start to do my own notebook so I wouldn't have like this much of stock. I at least do these ones and then I'll see if I have time to do all these other ones. I've also been printing with the two printers and it has been super super cool. With this one I've been uh, doing the notepads and with this one I've been printing other things like stickers and notebook covers and stuff like that and it's really really cool because notebooks, notepads take so so long so it's nice that I can do other stuff while I'm printing and it's been making the process super super fast and this is the big pile of notepads to mount. Uh, this is one of the new designs that I'm really really in love. It's the party animals one. Then I did, I'm going to restock the tea ones and I did the strawberry ones that you saw from the previous footage that I really really love as well. I also got a new shelving unit <laughs> that you probably already saw and now I have all my sheets a lot more organized because before I was keeping them all over here as you can see I still have uh, some things over here but now I can divide them by like categories and stuff like that so everything it's a lot more organized I just want to add some tags so I don't have to open all of them <laughs> when I'm searching for something. I also did these sticky sheets and I already stocked up um, some of them and I really really like how they turned out as well. I think they look super super cute. Actually on Monday it was a little bit frustrating because when I was doing like the list with all the materials and all that kind of things I noticed that the sticker paper that I was using it's no longer available in uh, European Union because the company is based on the UK so I normally bought uh, the evergreen goods uh, sticker paper and it was available on Amazon from Spain. That's the Amazon here in Portugal that we use because we don't have an Amazon here in Portugal. Um, and I went and checked all the other Amazons from the European Union and there's no sticker paper. And to order it from the UK, I'll have to pay for costumes. The shipping is super, super expensive. So yeah i already ordered a uh, different sticker paper to try out uh, but yeah it has been a mess because now i'll have to change sticker paper i'll have to change vinyl sticker and i really really like this vinyl and this sticker paper i already uh, tried with the sticker paper that i use for my logos but the quality is just not enough and you can see a lot of grain so yeah 
when I get that paper I'm going to uh, show you the difference and see if it's similar I really hope it is um, otherwise yeah I'll just have to maybe increase the prices and I really don't want that because with costumes and shipping and all that kind of things the sticker paper will get really really expensive but we'll see about that I'm going to try the brands that are now available on European Union and then We'll see about that. So yeah, I think we are going to start the mounting marathon. Wish me luck. Printers are running for with some more covers to restock. I then still need to print like the inside covers, but that's normally a lot faster than the covers itself. And I've been trying some new methods. Um, I did a notebook tutorial, if you haven't seen it, I'm going to leave it somewhere over the screen if you want to check that out. Um, and I just want to say thank you so, so much because a lot of you left comments saying that maybe uh, it will work better and it will be a lot faster if I would wait the sheets. So that's what I've been doing and it was so, so much faster. Um, so basically I just grabbed um, a little bit of sheets, then I've put them on the, the weight over here and then when it says 74 or 75 grams, it's because I have the 15 sheets. It was a lot faster. I still need to see if this will work on the A6 uh, notebooks because I cut A4 sheets in half so they might not be the same weight but yeah at least for the A5 notebooks and counting the A4 sheets it's a lot faster so yeah I just want to say thank you so so much for your help I also already arranged the shelving so that I have space for restocking the A6 notebooks as you can see I almost have no 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 notebooks left so yeah let's keep going I forgot to mention that I've cut my hair. I've been having some comments on vlogs saying it was so long and nice, but I felt like I needed to cut a little bit and it's super bad because I cut it myself. <laughs> but yeah. <laughs> I'm just going to sit down a little and draw um, and I'm going to be recording for an exclusive video for my patrons. So I guess I'll talk to you guys tomorrow and I'm sorry if the background noise it's a little bit too much but yeah the printers are running so yeah I'll talk to you guys tomorrow and we are going to mount a lot of notebooks and notepads. Bye! These are finally all ready. Let's get mounting them.
just finished stapling the notebooks and I count them and there's 215 notebooks I think I never made so many at the same time um, it's because I'm restocking old designs at the same time that I'm restocking newer designs and new new <laughs> designs so yeah there's a lot going on my wrist it's kind of hurting right now so I need to rest a little bit and my arm as well it's weird <laughs> uh, but yeah I never did so many in the future in the next few years I would love to have a team working with me and helping me with the production of all stationery and stuff like that that will be the dream and that will be so so cool but yeah for now I'll keep doing them at least uh, I can always change my mind we never know but I really it's like one of the products that it gives me a lot of pleasure and happiness to make so yeah I wish to keep doing them but yeah I'm going to rest for a little bit and then we are going to fold them and press them so yeah let's go These are all ready, finally. I end up not doing them all. I have a few more over there because my wrist was getting really tired and I already had a lot of these designs um, in this big pile over here. So if I just need them, I just restock them uh, super fast because I now just need to bend them and uh, cut them. So yeah. This big pile is done and I wanted to show you the new designs even though they are not cut yet and they are not pressed yet so they keep opening but here they are I really really like it this one as like an inside it's the same green as the outside and it's super simple like this um, and this is the strawberry one, like the background, it's a light pink, which I really, really like. And the inside is like this, which I love. Um, and yeah, these are the new designs that are coming to the shop um, on Saturday the 17th. These are the A5 um, and I think they look super, super cute. I really, really like the pattern. I think just next time I'll print them, I'll just try to make the pattern slightly bigger, especially on this one. Um, but I really, really like it. But compared to other designs, like I have these two over here, um, they are nicely pressed and cut. Um, but uh, yeah, you can see like this pattern here, it's a lot, lot bigger than the, the new ones. So maybe next time I'll try to do at least this pattern a little bit bigger. I think it would look a little bit uh, better. But yeah, uh, anyway, I'm still super, super happy with it. Um, and I can't wait for you to see them and tell me what do you think of these new ones. Can you see the difference of not pressed notebooks and the pressed ones? This really blows my mind, like these ones are all ready and done and these ones still need to go like to the press. Look at this. <laughs> so cool. So yeah, now I need to press all of these. I only have one small press, so um, some of them I just press them with a lot of books and it works just fine. Um, so yeah, I need to press them and then I'll just need to cut them with this 
big boy over here but uh, i think i'm going to press them now and i'm going to leave them uh, till tomorrow or even the weekend because i only have to take photos for the shop plate of the new design so i don't have to rush it and i prefer them f for to be nicely pressed and a little bit more um, time in there than just to rush it to cut them out so yeah i'm going to do that so i won't be finishing this on this studio vlog but i promise next week i'll show you all the finishing results and we are going to do the new notepad designs as well that i thought i was going to be doing this week but yeah um and we are also going to restock some more socks take product photos and all that kind of things so stay tuned for that I think I've showed you before, but these are the new notepad designs. I have all of these uh, to cut. Um, and this is the newer one. It's like the party animals theme. And it's going to be a square one, which I'm really, really happy uh, about. And then I also did these strawberry ones. They have like a very... Um, slight uh, grid pattern in here and I really really like them as well I just love pink and red and yellow so so much so I'm super super happy uh, with this notepad designs as well and all of this is going to be on the next shop update so I can't wait I'm going to go now and edit this studio vlog I also need to finish a patreon secret project that has been going on for a few months now and I can't wait to show you everything as well um, but I need to finish that and finish recording and editing a patreon exclusive um, vlog as well so yeah still a lot to do today I hope you enjoyed this week here in the studio I really need to uh, rest <laughs> this weekend because I'm sure it will be a full-on week and very very tiring because I still have a lot to do but yeah that's the date it's going to be at 5 p.m. 17th of April and I'm so so excited and the last job update I did it was in November so it was some time ago and yeah I'm really excited and happy and yeah I just can't wait for you to see everything on the shop so yeah i really hope you enjoyed this video i hope you have a nice week or week and a half depending when you're watching this video if you watch this far and if you really like this video please subscribe to my channel it really really helps and if you want to sign up to my patreon to help support my work that will mean the world as well so yeah i'll talk to you guys very very soon bye I forgot to film this week's shout out, so here it is. It's for Eclectic Erudit. She only has 16 subscribers, and I'm sure we can give her a lot more love than that. She does studio vlogs and art videos, and I'm sure you guys will like them as well. So, yeah, I'm going to leave her links in the description and go give her some love. See you guys next week. Bye!